Well, look, I'm what? Look, it's I just am going down a list, and apparently we're going to somebody who's the lead singer of the Rose, which is one of the people that I talked about when it came to like groups with a sound that is so unique. Do you know why the Rose sounds unique? It's this man right here, the lead singer. His name's Wu Sung. He just released a single called, or a solo is what I meant to say, called "The Day That I Died" or just "Day That I Died," which means is this gonna be Sad Boy Hours? It might be. Let's go ahead and join me in Sad Boy Hours. If you like this video, click the like button, subscribe, myself. But as always, subscribe. We're on the road to building a community and i want you to be a part of that oh pretty piano give me pretty piano and his very tasty voice and i'm just gonna melt like butter woke up to the tv this morning oh that is right in the ears your voice in my head like a recording oh man drowning in the words that i wish we never said while I count up all the teardrops as they pour in. Are you okay, Wusung? I think the answer is no. Oh, this every voice. Every time I play it mm. back again, Good I'm shit. right there where you left me. Standing in the kitchen lights, I swear that I It's the crackle, right? This oh. Honey, oh, good. I know. It's the little crackle in his voice that is the signature sound of him, and it's fucking good. Between this and like Jaehyun and stuff, we've had a lot of English k-pop songs we've got a lot of english songs that have been coming out that's been fucking glorious and it's really turning a page in my brain of like yeah this really works sometimes i can't tell if the piano is crying or if it's leaking honey Standing Pretty sure that's fucking honey. It's got a yellow to it. I swear that I won't ever leave this room. Oh, sorry. Hard to not honey, sing. Oh, God. The honey's going to catch on fire. You're going to have car... That's not how you make caramel. Never mind. Failed joke right there. <laughs> Oh yeah, go dude. Do that again. Oh no, give me wobbles like that. Never mind. The run. Man, I want to put this on my karaoke game immediately. Great contrast. Ending? Probably the ending. Slowing down a little. There's a hole in my chest. Cause the day that you left was the day that I died. Oh man. That was fucking good. That was real good. What a difference in song to listen to after we've had some very upbeat high tempo shit the past like four recordings uh recordings and whatnot where this time around because we're listening to a ballad it's just a more of a i needed that i needed that sort of like taste it's like when you're eating a meal you don't just mix all the ingredients together and then just eat one big glob you have them separately and then you have dessert and what a dessert this is his voice is tasty as fuck did you see that segue i just did i'm so proud of myself right there i he has the one of the most unique voices in k-pop slash k-rock his voice with it's that crackle it's the signature crackle i don't know how he does it i don't know how he makes his voice do the thing but he does and it it works really well i love that 
the main hook of the song when he goes up into the falsetto which that is the main part that is the climax that they're hitting right there besides the bridge climax that's like the climax of the song in the chorus it is so different than his normal voice his normal voice is lower it's cracklier and whatnot this the 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 high notes that they do in like the the room view that part is great and once again building contrast helps show momentum in a song when you have a low section of your voice for the most part and then when you hit chorus and you start hitting high notes it makes the emotion that you're trying to convey even much more intense and what's the emotion here we said it at the beginning of the the song it's sad boy hours it's 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 i'm a sad guy right now and i think this does a great it's and it's not even just like sad as in i'm sad this is very lamenting it's very lamenting and i'm not even talking about like lyrics and stuff just in the music you can tell it's slower even towards the end it does it does slow down just a tad bit and you kind of just have a piano you have is there even like any fucking percussion in this and i'm stuck in the aftermath honey i'll be no there isn't it's piano and then there's like little bits of sound chords playing in the background like to show that space because you need a lot of space in the song if you're going to be going up in the notes and uh doing a nice little wibble wobble on the that one part you need you need that space to be able to do that so it doesn't get overwhelmed by the instrumental and it doesn't the the focal focus here is that fucking thing the, the the intensity in emotion conveyed through vocals like that's that's the big thing here so uh great song great great ballad once again another english only song that we've listened to recently and all of the ones we've listened to have been pretty good i'm usually very resentive resentive res apprehensive of k-pop k-rock songs that are english only just because i don't prefer that i prefer the uh, having korean lyrics but i can it, it's still good it's still good so that's that's what i got here so we're gonna go ahead and hop into outro time if you like this video click like button it's good, good, makes me feel good about myself comment and subscribe we are on the road to 2k and we are trying to build a community and i want to build a community with you which means i need you to comment literally anything tell me how you feel about this uh song in general do you think it's pretty i want to know that i think it's pretty do i think i think you're pretty dude that was weird this got awkward I'm going to press the button now. Where's the button at? There it is. Goodbye. <laughs>